What is up ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Brandon Coin YouTube channel. And on today's video, we're gonna be talking about the new Nerd Miner update. So uh, just got in another batch of Nerd Miners without the cases and are getting those shipped out. And when I was checking online, I saw there was a new version. It's version uh, 1.8.1. And I was like, hmm, we getting more hash rate? No, we're not getting more hash rate, but there is some user interface uh, changes. So that's the normal user interface. It shows the hash rate there. We're still getting one mega hash, but if you slide it up, you get the clock interface, which we already knew about that. That's cool, yeah, you know, no big deal. But if you slide it up again, you get a price ticker interface. Obviously this is backwards because I'm using my selfie camera, but you have Bitcoin at the top, Ethereum, BNB, uh, Bitcoin Cash, Solana, Litecoin, XRP, and Doge. And obviously it shows you their price and then the percentage that they're up or down, I guess probably within the last 24 hours. And then you have your hash rate down here at the bottom and then your version number right there. So that's really cool uh, because, you know, if you want something on your desk and you wanna be able to see price tickers um, and also it's mining at the same time. So wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. That's what I'm talking about, ladies and gentlemen. This is what we need, little gadgets to make our life better that also mine. I don't see why everything can't mine because it's not like it's burning any power. Um, I think the LCD screen burns as much power as the little ESP32 chip on there. These things burn like two watts, three watts. So not even enough. You won't even be able to like see it on your power bill at the end of the month, literally. Um, so anyway, with that being said, new update. If you did buy a nerd miner from me, uh, from the BC-PC web store, which there is a link down below. We're getting more of them in. We're pretty much uh, just keeping ordering case at a time. Uh, the ones with cases are about to run out, uh, but we're having some new cases with a desk mount, like for like your nightstand or your desk or that kind of thing. Um, those should be available soon. Without the case, uh, they are still marked down to, I believe, I think they're 33. They might be 29. Don't hold me to it. But um, so without the uh, without the case, just the bare device, which you can run them with the bare device um, and you don't really have any issues as long as you don't slide it across metal. Um, and uh, those are still marked down. But all the ones from yesterday forward will ship with the new update. But if you bought one from me previously, these do have legitimate nerd nm minor um, serial numbers so you can go over to the nm flash website and update it yourself i will be doing a how-to video so that way you can figure it out um, i don't know if the little miners got an update i think this was mainly just for the big ones because it's not a uh nothing to do with hash power it's just a cosmetic thing but i thought that's really cool i can't wait till we get the new desk cases in because i want this on my desk uh, just sitting up so I can always just look at the prices right under my monitor. Um, but yeah, so thanks ladies and gentlemen for coming out. I really appreciate it. Let me check on the price for these for y'all real quick. All right guys, so I just went over to the website and checked and the um, uh, Nerd Miners are still on sale for $29.99 without a case. And then I am going to be selling those desk mounted cases separately. So just waiting on like the final production um, on those, which they are going to have an option to have a, a little built-in miniature fan that runs off of the actual device as well. Uh, because some people have said and expressed that these get a little warm and they do. That's why on these cases, they have like an air gap between them. And I don't think that'd be like an actual, like physical heat problem. Uh, but you know, I guess better be safe than sorry. And the little fan that's going to be mounted inside there burns like almost nothing um actually hold on i'll tell you all right guys so looking up some specs from them um they are 0.11 amp so times 12 that'd be what 1.2 watts uh for the fan on the back I, I don't know it's it's not much i mean i guess technically it's like running almost another nerd miner but still say they burn five watts for the fan and the nerd miner in a day times 24 hours, that's what? That's some 200, 120 watts, 120 watts a day. 
times 30 days. You know what? Quick, quick math here. Hi, Dad. Hey, buddy. 120 watts times 30 days. So you're looking at 3.6 kilowatts per month. 3.6 kilowatts per month times 0.14 because I pay 14 cents per kilowatt. So in a month, a nerd miner with the fan mount running 24 seven, which I don't know if we'll have it that way or not, but um, would burn right at 50 cents at 14 cents per kilowatt. Um, yeah, not even noticeable. Without the fan mount running, it would be like, end up being like 30 cents a month. Well, my kids are doing their thing. So I'll see you on the next one later, guys. By the way, guys, he came in here to show me his boo-boo because he hit his toe on the on the wall or the door. I couldn't really understand it. Yep. Anyway, link down below if you do want one. And uh, the how-to video to flash the new uh, software on should be coming up in the next day or two.